Destiny, we got as close to the scene as we possibly can so that we can give you a live look at exactly what is going on on the interstate. You can see behind me, crews are still very much at work. They're working to clean up 100 gallons of fuel that was spilled on the interstate this morning. Good news is one lane has reopened, so we have two lanes open right now. One is still closed but this is still causing quite the backup. We have exclusive video from Sky 4. Now, there were three separate wrecks involving two 18-wheelers and a truck carrying several vehicles. The uh, fuel spill actually came from the tractor trailers involved in this wreck. DHEC is here on the scene looking for, um, trying to figure out if they need to repave a portion of the interstate this afternoon. Now, as far as backup goes, unfortunately, we have not improved much from this morning. We are still backed up all the way to the gateway. Very slow moving traffic, so I would still advise you to find a detour around this. No word on when all this will be cleaned up. As of right now, the best detour, the best choice for you is to get off on 385, take 385 all the way to downtown Greenville. You're then going to get on Church Street and take that to 185 then we, where you'll continue to get on I-85 southbound but that is your best option right now this is going to impact I-85 southbound for quite some time we are live in the Greenville County Hannah Ward WYFF News 4